Hi there, welcome back to the channel. When it comes to download or save photos, videos, or audio, you might encounter this. Couldn't download a video or images, try again if this happen, if, if this keeps happening, turn up the Wi-Fi, VPN, or connecting to a different network. But don't worry, in today's video, I'll give you a very easy way to solve that problem. And after that, it will allow you to download anything that you want to download from your WhatsApp. So without wasting any more time, let's go. Now, before you get started, the first thing you guys really want to take a look at is the net connections. So go to the control panel here and take a look at your network connections. If you see, well, your iPhone is connected to Wi-Fi, then what I really recommend you guys to do, turn up your Wi-Fi and go back and enable your mobile data and try to download the same file and check whether it works or not. If you see well, uh, even if it's not working on mobile data, you can enable airplane mode for about 10 to 20 seconds and then you can turn it off. Right after that, all you guys want to do is simply go ahead and open up your WhatsApp applications here. You want to go to the settings. Uh, you want to go to this option called storage and data. And here, you want to just simply enable this option called media auto download. So for photos, make sure to select Wi-Fi and cellular data. Also for audio, select Wi-Fi cellular, video, Wi-Fi cellular, and documents, select Wi-Fi cellular. You want to go back and open up your chat sections and you want to make sure to enable this option called safety photos, okay? And right after that, simply get out of here and restart your iPhone. Now, most likely your problem is definitely going to be solved after following this quick tricks however if that doesn't help it can do last two work you can go to the settings you can go and open up your general tap on iphone storage so make sure you have the available storage available on your iphone if you have less than a let's say two or three gigabyte um then you can you know delete some of these un unused applications from these iphone storage the very same time if you see you all you have enough storage but you face the same problems you want to find out the WhatsApp from the iPhone store. So let me search this up, select that, tap offload, tap offload again, and then tap rinse the lab. Don't worry, this is not going to delete any of your data. And right after that, all you guys need to do is simply get out of here, open up your software browser, and you want to type uh, fastfast.com. This website will pretty much tell you how much current internet speed that you're having. You can see it's actually less than 10 gigabyte. If you see, well, you're having poor internet connections, then I would highly recommend you guys just talk to the internet provider and tell them you ha you're having problems with the internet. And after that, your problem is going to be solved. Now, open up your WhatsApp and go to the chat and open up anything that you want to download. And hopefully, it will start to download everything from your iPhone. So that's the way of downloading, um, you know, the photos or videos or audios or documents on iPhone. And still, if you guys have been requesting to ask, please let me know in the comment section, guys. See you all around.